Nikki Rich, and today we would like to welcome to the Nikki Rich Show, Dr. Fitness USA. Tell your friends, tell your family that the Nikki Rich Show is on right now. So with no further ado, I'm excited and I'm honored to welcome Dr. Fitness USA. So the thing is, the easiest thing, the most fun thing that a woman can do is to be in a proper environment and to have my prescription strength training program so that she can train in an appropriate manner that would produce a younger person. Which leads me to the second thing, you know. Uh, you know, we're in Hollywood, so to speak, so you gotta get somebody's attention. So what happens is I would say, it could be a man or a woman, and I say, um, do men steal women's youth? Could be vice versa. Mm -hmm. But men steal women's youth every single day because for most men, when they find a woman that's intellectually smart, they're gonna use you and get you to do all the work till you drop because women who go up inside their head haven't learned how to say no to loved ones in order not to hurt themselves. So they're gonna keep on working until they actually get sick. We try to get, uh, and that's another thing because the inner generation, or right now, the men have become so weak that the women are doing everything. So we try, we don't try, we teach women with their newfound energy or strength and their new appearance or physical, physicality in their body that they can delegate authorities and get men to do the work. So they can go to the gym and take care of their body. And, and you, you also provide these one-on-one sessions. I, I do it all. The thing <laughs> is, to, I don't do it personally. I'm a designer, so I oversee mm -hmm. what's happening. But what's happening, you need a script of what to do in the gym. Uh, like I met a woman yesterday, and she's a little bit overweight, but the same thing is she's totally lost. You know, she goes to the gym, but she doesn't know that she has really good legs, and she can change the upper formation of her body. Because some women, uh, what happens in life is their body gets like a rounded position because their muscles aren't supporting their posture correctly, and so it looks more like the hunchback in order dame and that makes them feel uncomfortable. They don't know it really what that is, but it's not something they're comfortable with. The clothes don't fit right, but they don't know that that's reversible in my system, and there's evidence to that. So uh, there's a whole world, what I'm going to get at is there's a whole, and, and anyways, Batista Grimaud, who you heard previously, is the highest level teacher in the world. She started off as a personal trainer, and she's a seventh degree level teacher in the art of body design. So she, what I do is I promote her in the sense that she's your mentor, your role model. If you want me personally, well, it's gotta be a good fit, and I wanna read your story to see if you really wanna change your body. Because I do a lot of podcasts, and, you, and some of the women are tremendously overweight, and they go, yeah, this is great, this is what I want. But the same thing, why haven't they made a telephone call? They need to make a telephone call to cause an action to ask clarifying questions. Mm -hmm. But they can't because they're in their head. So that's another thing that I'm getting to is if you're in a relationship and it's a man, they need to actually take a woman to the gym and say, uh, here's the gym, I'm gonna wait outside and do it two or three times and it'll become a habit. They, women don't necessarily, they're not like guys. You see, we guys are kind of like babies. You know, if we get sick, we're like little babies. But women don't necessarily say, gee, I'll go tr train at the gym. They, they usually have a to-do list. I, I, I need to do one more thing, one more thing, uh, time, time, time. They're on this time clock. Mm -hmm. So being strong, hurrying up, pleasing others is not the signs of a feminine woman. So we try to get women to set better standards for themselves and get the universe to take care of them. Because it's a man's world, but it's a woman's universe. And you know, for every great man, there's a greater woman about to pass him, especially with my program, because we uh, will help you get there. And Dr. Fitness, I know um, you're talking about the different programs. Where could we go and learn about your programs? One last thing is, so there's a woman that's friends with Batista, 
and uh, she's kind of like uh, overweight. Uh, she hasn't taken care of herself in a long time. And she's asking, uh, she makes an appointment with me, but the husband says no. So she cancels the appointment with Batista. And I say, Batista, why don't you call her? She can't move this woman out of her place. But here's where the body design is different. In my sleep, I remember she doesn't know what I'm talking about because she can move around and she's still breathing and she works. So her idea, uh, your definition of fitness is really important. So I ask her, I call her on the phone, I say, hi, so-and-so, how are you doing? They say, oh, Dr. Fitness, this is great. And I say, hey, listen, can you do me a favor, a real favor? Yeah, sure. Uh, could you hold your arms out like this? And she says, yeah. I said, are you really holding them out? She says, yeah. And I said, you notice that there's a lot of things hanging down from the arms. She says, oh, there's a lot of it. I said, that's medical disease setting into the body. So the women out there that are standing around with too much uh, excess weight is letting medical disease set into the body. And another reason that you do strength training is because women produce less blood cells, so they need to create more muscles, which requires more oxygen, and then they would lose weight faster while resting. And in closing, I would say is that you, to be successful, you only have to work out once a week for about 40 minutes, uh, maximum three times if you're, uh, as you go along in life. But you can go to the gym on a program and be in and out of the gym within 40 minutes. Mm -hmm. You can't beat that. And that strength or those good feelings will last you for two or three weeks. So you can go on vacation, come back, pick up, go, go in the driveway, take your beautiful car for a run, and you can have a really great time with yourself. So the answer is strength training is your number one tool to grow younger. And we men always support that. Or at least yeah. I do. Well, I'm just so excited for you and strength training and everything we discussed today. We want you guys to definitely go check out Dr. Fitness USA. You can go to drfitnessusa.com. And also, we thank Ms. Batista for being our guest. Much love. And guys, you are watching The Nikki Rich Show. You just heard the exclusive interview with Dr. Fitness USA. It was amazing. You can go check it out also at thenickyrichshow.com. We have our official website. And you can go to social media to our Instagram, Facebook, and Twitter at Nikki Rich Show TV. So check us out as well and subscribe to our YouTube, Nikki Rich Tips.